Haley Van Lith was an eighth grader when the Cashmere girls were bounced out of the state tournament in 2016 by Kalama. They haven't been bounced since. But the chase for the elusive gold ball has been slippery for Van Lith and her teammates. Senior Grace Erdman says it became kind of funny. It, it was almost laughable to us because we're like, are you kidding me? Another year? Another year. Like the first time was one point and then the second year was two points. We're like, so what's next year? Three points? Like, but it's, it's heartbreaking, but it makes you want it. It makes you want it more. So yeah, coming into this season last year to get it done, I'm hungry. I'm hungry for that gold ball. Cashmere took second in 2017, losing by one to Mount Baker. Then they took second in 2018, losing by two points to Lyndon Christian. They lost in the semifinals to LaSalle last year and ended up taking third. So do the girls talk about it? Well, I'd say we talk about it just because so many people talk about it to us, so we have to address it. Yeah. Like me right now. Yeah, yeah. So many people talk about it. So obviously we've addressed it, and we know that it's a possibility, but we know – like we came in our freshman year, we had a perfect record. And so you're never safe. You always have to stay hungry. You always have to be on your best game because anyone that plays us is going to be on their A game. They want to beat us. So we just want to, we need to have that more of a hungry mentality and more of a, we're going to win this game. Yeah, it definitely fuels things. Um, it's definitely super heartbreaking. And it can be that close and be taken from you. But um, that just goes to show it's not easy to raise that gold ball. So that just motivates us every day and gets us working hard at practice and being competitive. Even though we're um, great teammates to each other off the court, we know that we can be competitive because it'll make us better. It's, it's crazy to think that we have an opportunity to do something that's never done before and um, create history in our small town of Kashmir. And I just think that's a really special opportunity and um, I just want to make the most of it. My goal is um, obviously to get a state championship with a bunch of girls that I've grew up with and it's been really fun practicing, like getting prepared for it. And so that's been a goal since like, obviously since I was little, but it's kind of came a reality, like last year as being a freshman, and then now it's like kind of becoming more real as like we're a better team this year, and I think we have a pretty good chance, so. Um, and just to never quite get there after we um, push ourselves so hard has been something that was hard for us to deal with, and I think um, this year it would just be overwhelming emotion, and doing it with my best friends um, and a coach that um, I'll have a friendship with for the rest of my life is something that I don't know what I'll feel. Probably a lot of tears of joy. That's all I'm gonna, all I can maybe see happening. It's funny how the girls talk about it, but Coach Brent Darnell says he doesn't. I know the talk is with all social media and stuff, it constantly gets brought up, but I don't spend a lot of time talking about it. Like, we never set a team goal to even win a league championship. Like we never sit down and say, let's win league this year, or our goal is to win districts. Like I, I never put that those goals on us. Try to put goals on us where, you know, rebounding goals and taking care of the ball this game and limit turnovers and let's just try to meet these small goals every single game. Those are the ones that I really try to focus on. So, um, and, and we've been pretty good at that all year long. I mean, we've met a lot of those goals. So if it happens, great. If it doesn't, then the stars didn't line up right. Whether it's spoken or not, the goal is to be standing on the floor of the Sun Dome Saturday night hoisting the elusive gold ball. With NCW Life Channel Sports, I'm Eric Grandstrom.